Welcome back. Well, you know we love to highlight local entrepreneurs, and we're doing just that today. We've got Jovi Thomas here with Wooden Embers, and this, all of these pieces are just amazing. It, and let's talk about kind of your style and how you go about doing this art. Well, I started about eight years ago and just started burning. I saw it in a blog and went from there, and then it kind of... I elevated into doing burning furniture, and I do a lot of just smaller home decor, and then I have more of like the artistic type too. Mm. And I recently started doing hats. It's so. amazing, really. And so Thank what you. would you say would be your your main focus to when it comes to design? Oh, um, I don't know. It's, a, it's something that actually, especially with furniture, I'll find it, mm -hmm. and I can envision a design right away. Mm. So, and then once I get it down to its bones and I sand it and everything, I can just freehand and start making a design that speaks to me. Yeah, let's talk about this furniture that you yeah. brought up here in front. So, and that's exactly what kind of the process that you went through with this? Yes. Okay. Yeah, it started with that old orange mm -hmm. stain mm -hmm. and sanded it down to the beautiful wood that it is and did a burn design on the top and then I usually use paint or stain to kind of help bring some color in mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that, that I think that that's just fascinating to me that you can see you can see a table or you can see salt and pepper yeah. shakers and be like, you know what, let's just let's, let's make put this some, better. Let's yeah. put some uh -huh. flowers on it, you know? I think that that's so cool. Yeah, so let's talk about um, the different things that you create. So everything from, you know, the well, jewelry box, you know, a little, little add-on to that. Um, some eggs, too, for Easter. Yeah, these are new. Uh, so really I've cute. actually been doing, so these wildflower designs are usually my best sellers. Mm -hmm. um, I've featured it on a few furniture pieces, mm -hmm. but mostly it's the mushies that yes. are just, everybody loves them. So then I started kind of gravitating doing some bigger ones, and then now I have the wooden eggs for Easter. But yeah, the wildflower design is definitely one, it's the best seller for sure. Mm -hmm. And you do a lot of it freehand, you don't do stencils? Yeah, the only time I do stencils is if I do furniture and if I need to repeat the pattern like on a dresser. Sure. But most of the time, that's even me creating my own stencil and then using that as a... That yeah, something that's to go off of. Mm -hmm. So what uh, what is your favorite types of pieces to do? I prefer to do find like the really antique, like I did mm -hmm. a um, an antique washstand that I found on oh. the side of the road and mm -hmm. I was like, I can do a lot with that. And yeah, definitely the older pieces are mm -hmm. my favorite because they usually have more architecture in the wood, in the shapes. And obviously my stuff is very feminine, so mm -hmm. those curves and that design mm -hmm. go really well with the flowers, I think. And I feel like it really just, uh, you know, with, with, the, with the bones of that, you're able to accentuate what's already there exactly. with mm -hmm. the, the flowers. So with the, the, the entire piece just begins to sing and come alive. Definitely. Yeah, let's talk about from start to finish, how long would something like, like the egg take? Ooh. <laughs> well, know? with time now, because since I have like eight years under my belt, mm -hmm. the wildflowers and those kind of things don't actually take that long. But if I'm doing a furniture piece, that can take me up to a month sometimes okay. or mm. longer because mm -hmm. the process is sure. there's a lot into it. Mm. Yeah, so do you have to do you go through it once? You have to go through it again, or is it just one um, layer? Or? Well, because you like if I'm doing furniture, I have to sand everything down sure. and then make sure that it's you know kind of upcycled. I guess mm -hmm. you'd say make sure that you know any um, flaws are hidden and that sort of thing. Then I go mm -hmm. in with my burn designs and go through drawer by drawer or the top, or then you have to paint, you have to seal. So yeah, it does. It's it's a process, but I completely love it. But like the mushies and stuff like that. Yeah, I can do those like 20 minutes or Easy. so. Yeah. They're so cute. Yeah, <laughs> so they cute. are adorable. How can people get their hands on your products? And you're only online right now, right? Yes. So I am usually selling through Facebook Marketplace, and it's just uh, my page, uh, Wooden Embers. All right. Thanks so much for being I mean, here today. Thank you very much. And we'll have more when we come back on Cato Living.